Well, hello there, everybody. This is Mike and I, Sissy Five, and welcome back to another episode of Corona Trigger. Today with me, I have a special guest. Introduce yourself. My name is FollowMeFan231 on YouTube, or just call me Eric the Squirrel, or just randomly call me Squirrel. Squirrel! <laughs> so, welcome to the episode. In the last episode, um, Chrono came back! Yay! He revived from the dead, and we also did an annoying frickin' boss for a stupid side quest. And this episode, died. we'll do more! What? Chrono died? <gasps> Spoiler! Yeah, I've never beaten this game. It's one of those cases because uh, when you get older, you don't have enough time in order to play these RPGs, because there's a ton of RPGs I want to play right now, like Renaissance of Fate for PS3 and 360. As soon as I play, I'm like, yay, I'm on the third chapter of whatever, then after a few days, I stop playing for about a month or so. Wait, you've never beaten Chrono Trigger? I haven't. <laughs> oh, dude, why didn't you tell me? I don't mind. I mean, it's an old game. I don't really mind a spoiler. Uh, oh, how far did you play before? Uh, I honestly, I believe it's when you are in the BC times. Which and which time? First or second? The BC times, I believe, where you basically meet that uh, cave, that cave woman. Ayla? Yeah. The first time? Yep. Oh. <laughs> See, I'm lazy. Sorry! I feel so bad now! <laughs> Squirrel is one-minded. I'm so sorry, I like spoiled like the main plot of this well the, like a huge part of this game. Why are you why are you saying sorry? I really don't mind it. It honestly doesn't bother me. Oh, okay. I still feel really bad. It's fine, I'm not Alright, well, even though you've never played this game, how about okay, we no, have a few it. Well, yeah, but not to this point. So, do you want me? So, should I go take on a guy named Ozzy? Should I go get a rainbow shell? Should I go get a sunstone? Um, should I go Ooh, figure out who that close rainbow shell? <laughs> rainbow shell, shiny squirrel hunts. <laughs> you want to do that one? Sure, why not? All right, What's that's six hundred eighty. Uh, even though I haven't played through all of this, I know that Square needs to make a sequel. Stop with Final Fantasy! Final Fantasy's dead! Oh yeah, and uh, for those of you who saw the last episode, um, even though you got Robo back, he will still be gardening. So you got a little time paradox here. God, if water, <laughs> my petunias! No! Stop! No! Get away from my flowers! <laughs> get away! Yeah, time paradox. <laughs> time paradox. Is he? Is he wearing? Yeah, he's actually wearing. Yeah, he he's wearing a little hat thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. All right, so for the next thing we have to do, is, let's see, I think it's. Yeah, I think we have to go to this place. It's been a while since I've done these side quests. So I don't remember everything. Oh, what good can news. I get in the market? What? Uh, good, good news for everyone. Uh, apparently, from what I've heard, I believe Square is actually starting up on Kingdom Hearts 3 soon. Oh yeah, I did hear about that, actually. Yes, thank god! No more freaking spin-offs! As, right. as, as much as I'm excited for the 3DS Kingdom Hearts game, how many spin-offs are out there? A lot. <laughs> more than I can count. It's, a, it's, it's getting sequelitis. Oh god, I hope it gets sequelitis. Uh, that would be hysterical. What am I doing? What am I doing? I don't know. What are you doing? For some reason, I want to go stay at the inn. I'm pretty sure my HP was full. But whatever. Why not? It was only 10G. Alright. Now we need to go find a guy named Toma. Toma? Toma. Interesting. Not name. in here. No. Is he even in this city? Oh yeah, there he is. Hello! Oh, he's in a bar. Hey, Chrono, I finally got lit on the rainbow shell. Alright. <laughs> but there's nothing good going on. Oh, can you hang out for this for me? Sure. Toma, yes. stop! Yes, we'll go for the Dark Knight voice. I don't know if I can upon this on my head stuff. See, this is, isn't this morbid? <laughs> Quite okay. morbid. Alright. Um, so he said you have to go put this on his gravestone, correct? 
Okay. Well... Time to go into the future! Yeah, he, I'm just gonna tell you now, he doesn't make it. Quickly, go 18 so, miles per hour. Let's go to 1000 AD. 800 miles per hour! <laughs> Whee! Alright. And now, we have to go to West Cape. And there's a tombstone here. The great adventurer Toma Levine rests here. Actually, he's lasted 30, 34 more years after we talked to him. That's good. He was a brave adventurer indeed, who died of an aneurysm. <laughs> <laughs> he and was a now its tombstone is stained. Yeah. Forever. <gasps> it's Toma! Long time no see. No, wait. Oh. Long time no see. <laughs> The Rainbow Shell! Hooray! <laughs> Rainbow Shell? Why do I have the Lord and Lord? Now I need to watch My Little Pony. <laughs> oh god, no. <laughs> no, I'm not a brony. <laughs> Alright, bye. You never know. Dun dun dun. Are you gonna read this or not? <laughs> <laughs> to the northwest of this cave is a large island called the. <coughs> Excuse me. Jay's Claw. You can find the shell there. Alright. And the little brings us back to the past. And now we have to go there. What? Do I do better impressions than your sister? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> do not bring my sister into this. There are many beasts about. I am the knight! <laughs> time, time to shove off. Shoot, let me sleep. Back to his eternal rest. He's hey look, his heaven. gemstone's gone. Oh, clean now. Yeah, he's going to heaven. No, wait, no, he went to hell. Oh, wait, one more yeah. line, dude. You guys are right in a minute! See ya! Bye, Toma! That was, that was nice. Alright, so now we gotta go back to 600 AD. Oh, no, wrong way. I don't want to go to the apocalypse just yet. He never <laughs> paid the waitress for his drink. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> so here's the place he was talking about, and we go in through here. Oh, crap. This is all so new to me. <laughs> Do you know how long we've been recording? Because I kind of forgot to turn on my timer. Again. <laughs> oh boy. Let me guess, over 30 minutes? <laughs> I'm sure it's not that long. Maybe. I don't know. Those holes. What if I jump into them on purpose? <gasps> yes! I'll start back at the beginning, and... Dot, dot, dot. Okay. I, I completely forgot what it said, but that's okay. Now, doesn't this look familiar? Not to me. Is this Tyrant a layer? Looks side to side. This has been pushed underground when that was fell to Earth. Must have. Must have? <laughs> oh god, enemies. And... It's a dragon! No, wait, it's a Gigasaur! No, it's uh, a Uh, lightning too. A Gigasaur! Oh, wait! Oh, I forgot! I was supposed to put Ayla in my party, not Chrono. Oops, derp fail. Lightning from a ball fall! Oh, well, at least our power decreases when we're shocked. And yes, I will Ultra do it over 9,000. <laughs> if, if the damage goes over 9,000, I'm doing it over 9,000. Joke! But it wasn't 9,000. Uh, I know, if it does happen. Is that even possible in this game? I don't know, maybe. I'm pretty sure. I did that. I don't even know if I can get in, in the thousands. I don't know. I don't know, because I'm too freaking lazy with this game. <laughs> you need to play it more. It's such a good game. I know, it's, I just for some reason get lazy. I do like it. It's not that I hate it. I never said that. I'm just saying you need to play it more. Heal beam again. Oh, no, heal. Game. Heal. Heal. <laughs> Game. Heal beam. Thank you. It's not listening. <laughs> Hates me. Jeez. Always hated me. <laughs> because you're playing too hard on it. You're. You can pwn the game easily. But I have it on wait. <laughs> you have it on. <laughs> That's like easy mode in this game. I, always, I never put it on weight. I always put it on active. Can't do that. I it, I would make too many stupid decisions. 
I like it on active. It's, uh, it's, uh, even when I played, yeah, I like it on active. Why? Because I like a challenge. You got a new dual tag. Ooh, <gasps> triple tag. Sweet. I want to show that off, actually. I've, I haven't been showing off a lot of my uh, text recently. <sighs> Very nice. Oh, I remember the text. Nah. If I remember, nah. My last party, if I remember, I prefer uh, Chrono Frog and uh, Luca. Actually, my favorite party is um, Chrono, Marley, and Ayla. Uh, yeah. Oh, hey, there's green, green fire. Never seen green, green fire. fire. It must be hotter than blue. Oh, I was about right. to sneeze. <laughs> Random oh, cave. Okay, we can't go in here yet. Yeah, exploring the cave. I wonder if there are Zubats. Oh, God. No Zubats! You want to know what I love about caves and Pokemon? All the Zubats! Shut up! <laughs> oh, hey, more bats. Yay! Lizard Dactyls, alright. Yeah, yeah, I jinxed it. You were the one who jinxed it. I didn't say anything about him. <laughs> so, thanks. Oh, what? <laughs> oh, you had a derp fail. Oh, <laughs> derp, what? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Derp. Oh no. Derp just healed him, boobs. Great. They're invading your personal space. <laughs> Leave me alone! Invading your personal space. Get away. I. Uh... Oh, it's like the last boss all over again. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm serious. Like, I could not attack them at all. They would, they would attack me, like, in. Group of three. Fire, fire. <laughs> Did that do damage to them? I wasn't paying attention. It oh does no, Luca! Luca's it, confused. It does damage. Okay, good. <laughs> Trust me, I know. Uh, yeah, it does damage. Wee! Laser light show! Ray! Sweet rape! Mm, sweet! Mm, mm, mm. Sweet rape party! Mm, 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 mm. Okay. Well, Come on, guys! Seriously? At least you're not taking a lot of damage. I know, but this is ridiculous. Yeah. And great, now two of my party members are uh, confused. Lovely. I don't mind this. It's just that when the point where I'm playing the game so long where my patience wears thin, I decided, uh, no, not to do it for grinding. <laughs> Look at Robo. He's like, ah, 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 no, no, ah, no, no, ah. No. He's numbing the tail. Um, num, num, num. <laughs> or he's doing a little dance. And making the love. Get that nice. No, they're not being confused. No, they're hypnotizing them to make them dance. <laughs> uh, oh my god, this just is die. Just, <laughs> These things are ridiculous. Is, oh, there we go. This is bring memories of Final Fantasy VII. <laughs> yes. Yes, I like that game. I actually I never... that game. That game's not too bad when you give it a chance. The thing I like about it is this. I don't want to hear Cloud or Sephiroth talk. In that game, they don't talk, which is better. Because whenever Cloud talks, he sounds like some kind of whiny, emo teenager in high school. <laughs> hey, it's true. <laughs> well, I mean, it's just... I, I look, It's not that I don't like the game, I just find it overrated. That's all. Yeah, it's overrated. Really overrated. Along with games like Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. Yes, I said it! I no. said it! I said no. it! <laughs> no. I love that game. I, I didn't say it's bad. I just think it's overrated. <laughs> I said it! Oh, send, me, send me hate mail! <laughs> I will take you all on! <laughs> kitty! No! Poor kitty! Like Kitty probably hates me now. <laughs> you didn't save it a time, poor kitty. Can I not press this? I don't think I can press this. Now what's the point of this room? Hey, it's a water fountain. <laughs> oh, they fell down. Oh, they fell down with kitty. <laughs> we gotta go save the kitty. Where's the kitty? No, I don't want to fight you guys unless there's a the kitty. Too late. The uh... kitty's gone. Kitty, be oh dead. man, there's something in my eye. Hey, don't <laughs> do that. Oh damn. Stop it. Stop They're like it. Eight bets. Ow. Poor Luca. 
<laughs> yeah, better get some potions on that. We just got our ass kicked. I mean, seriously. <laughs> oh god, no. <laughs> Hopefully the kitty's still alive. Maybe it ran into another room. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully, then all of a sudden you hear. And then it claws my face out. <laughs> Randomly traps from the shadows. No, that's. It's cat's... like, why aren't you going for the thing that's attacking me? No, it's a forest shadow. The cat's going to be the final boss. <laughs> How did you know? <laughs> because I looked up on game facts. <laughs> you cheater! Yay, I'm cheating on an old 1990s game. Or, I don't remember what year this came out. I think it was 1994? Yeah, but I could be wrong. It's definitely older than I am. Yep, I've never played this game. I never had a Super Nintendo as at a young age. This I game was my childhood, man. Like, I'd always just sit around watching my brother play this game, and then I finally picked it up when I was like five. Yeah. Good times, man. The RPG I grew up with was Paper Mario, the original. Oh, yeah. We used to always... I don't remember if we actually ever had it, but we always used to get it... I remember... I don't remember if we used to get it off of Blockbuster or if we actually had it. But I know nah. we had it at one point. I find it amazing. I kind of... I think I actually enjoy Paper Mario more than I did with Mario 64. And that's kind of strange. No, I like... Um, because I like Paper then, Mario so much more than, um, than, Super Mar uh, than Super Mario 64. Then again, I haven't. I think it's weird because Super Mario I guess back then, because back then I remember playing that game, and um, I was just I was uh, I was like like with everyone else back in the day, like RPGs. People would look at people would if they saw Final Fantasy and they say, "What? You're not fighting them? It's not an action game? You're waiting your turn? This sounds boring." That was essentially me. I didn't like RPGs. As soon as I would see one, I was just thinking, eh, it's like chess, it's boring. But then, Paper Mario's like, ooh, this looks nice, and what? What is this? What is this blasphemy? As soon as I played it, then afterwards, I was addicted to it. But then, in fact, if I remember, yeah, Paper Mario, I actually remember playing the game, beating the final boss, and actually recording it on VHS. Aww. <laughs> yeah, my fr my uh, siblings used to do that too. Like, I actually have video cassettes in my room of my um, my dad and my brother playing Final Fantasy VI, uh, Chrono Trigger, and um, I think Banjo Kazooie. Yeah, <laughs> yep. That was I, that was the first time I ever recorded video. That was the only time I ever did that back in the day. <laughs> yes, I was doing LPs back then before you all thought it was cool. <laughs> <laughs> you did LPs before it was a thing. <laughs> yeah. Nah, I, I, <laughs> Paper Mario, I love the death. That was when I got into RPGs to begin with. Mm -hmm. uh, it just sucks how I've just always been into them. It just sucks how RPGs are now. I mean, some of them are really good. Like I heard, I haven't, I haven't um, seen Last Story yet, but isn't that coming out in North America pretty soon, or did it already come out? Actually, it is coming to North America. The Last yeah. Story. Yeah. Yeah. I, I just don't. I don't. Had it come out yet? I because I know it is coming out. I just don't know when. It's coming out. I believe. Oh next my month goodness! Did you July. see that? You yep. like lag. Lag. <laughs> Let no. Don't blame I mean, the game. No, gamers do not rage over the game. Lag makes gamers like uh makes gamers rage. <laughs> Definitely. Uh, but yeah, um, not nah, if anything, I recommend uh what was it? Yeah, like I said. Um, it's a game I suggest that if you are watching this, it's called Renaissance of Fate. It's for PS3 and 360. There's also Star Ocean The Last Hope for 360. Mm -hmm. Although, get the PS3 version, and there's a reason why. It's because on the PS3, or on the 360 version of Star Ocean The Last Hope, it's on three or four discs. I believe three. But yeah, it's on three discs. The PS3 version has more options for you to choose, like changing the dialogue to Japanese, plus it's on one disc. Sounds like a better deal than me. Yay for the PS3! Plus, my brother has a PS3, so... You need to get one. Why? Because Renaissance of Fate. I'm sorry, Well, that... I mean, my brother moved in with me, so I can just... Definitely try it out, because Renaissance... Imagine if, uh... Renaissance of Fate plays, like, a Japanese RPG game. Only difference is that the battle system... 
battle system is one of the most unique I've ever seen. Mm -hmm. I can't, I really can't describe how it works because it's really complex. Just look it up on YouTube. But, yeah, that and it's really, really hard. Although, I like that. Yeah, I like to games that are really hard. And Trust why me. won't these things die? Have I been doing damage? Because I haven't really been paying attention. Yeah, you have. Okay, good. So why are they taking so long? Oh, really. that's why. <laughs> they haven't been doing much damage. Pretty that much. makes sense. Oh, no! Luca! Phoenix! No! Phoenix down! Oh, wait, no, that's revive. Oh, never mind. Yeah, they're, they're pretty a plane. No! no! I didn't <laughs> want to do that one. I wanted to do spin cut. Dang it, game. <laughs> Don't blame the game. Blame the player. <laughs> no, this is... No, actually, I'm blaming this on my gamepad. My gamepad's retarded. <laughs> Get a better one. <laughs> I can't no, I love it. I got a 360 gamepad. It work. It's working fine. It's just that I hate the buttons. It's one of those third-party controllers. No, where okay. It's one of, where the third-party controller buttons, where the buttons, the buttons are basically like pure plastic, like really, really loud. In fact, I have it right here. Listen. See, mm. it's very loud. Other than that, I'm glad I have it. And oh, hey, you're losing HP. Oh, wait, no, never mind. Yeah, I'm good now. <laughs> Thank wait, God. How, wait, how did you kill it? It looked like it's Chrono threw a rock. No, uh, Luca shot a gu shot her gun. <laughs> yes, use it. Toss this rock. <laughs> gotcha gun. <laughs> and only a few of you will probably understand what I just referenced. I, what did you reference? Um, a game called uh, uh, Arc Rise Fantasia. For some reason, I was gonna say Grand Fantasia, but that was like, no, that's an MMO. I have never played that. The main RPG I played on the PS3, or no, PlayStation 1. Final Fantasy 7, obviously. Final Fantasy 9, much better. And the, oh, and yes, definitely. Much better than Final Fantasy 7, and all the characters don't have the freaking Popeye arms. And, uh, Legend of Dragoon. Oh wait, no, there's also, uh... Frick, I can't remember. Uh... Our Tri Tri of Fantasia isn't on the PlayStation 1, though, it's on the Wii. Oh wait, it is. Oh. Uh-huh. Okay, hey. Oh, Squirrel is confused. <laughs> yeah, uh, my friend Creed is actually LPing it right now, and it's... It's, it's a really good LP, I, I suggest you watch it. <laughs> I haven't... was it? Uh... If one game I wish to do an LP on, um, just for fun's sake, I know there's a lot of them I want to try. One of which I have been playing a bit recently is Drill Dozer. Mm -hmm. Drill Dozer, essentially for the Game Boy Advance, is made by the people who made Pokemon. <gasps> yes, they actually made other games besides Pokemon. <laughs> Thank what God. What a plot twist! Pretty much, because to be fairly honest, I'm kind of tired of Pokemon. I am mm. not a huge fan. I've always had a weird relationship with Pokemon because I remember watching the anime, then hating it afterwards, and then... I love the anime, only the first uh, season. Oh, yeah, that's what I mean. Because as soon as, like, the first season is awesome, and then later on it's, it kept dragging on and on. Do you know how many episodes there are? Like, 2,000, 3,000? Over 700. Oh. <laughs> Well, hey, oh, you know what? I'm, I'm probably thinking of like Naruto or something. Hey, it's close. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. we've got a new triple tack between Luca, Robo, and Magnus. A ring of fire. <laughs> oh, yep. actually, wait. How long? Oh, we we need to uh, end off. <laughs> okay. You could do another one if you want to. Hey. Huh? You can do another one if you want. It's fine. All right. Hey, hey I don't mind joining again. Yes, you might be seeing more of him later. We'll have to that day said like Seppi went to the comments going, No, throw the squirrel out, put him in his cage. <laughs> we don't want him anymore. <laughs> no, I'm sure they won't be like that. Right, guys? Of course you liked him. They're probably just All yeah. right. I um, don't want to go to the vet. I don't want my shots. <laughs> in the next episode, we're going to continue going through this cave and see where it takes us, and hopefully we'll get the rainbow shell. This has been... Hopefully there's no more for the vets. <laughs> this has been... This has been...
Yes? <laughs> You're not gonna say your name? <laughs> this has been Fummy Fan 31 or Eric the Squirrel, whatever the hell you wanna call me. And I want to thank him again for coming onto the show. Well, episode, whatever. Yeah, we can call this a show, why not? This is the Chrono Trigger Show, okay? By Mike and I 65, and it's awesome. Alright. With your hosts! <laughs> Mike and I 65! Woo! Alright. Uh, well, I hope you enjoyed this, and I will see you in the next one. Mike and I 65, out.